Metro Schools is considering adding bulletproof films to doors and windows, but where would the money come from to get it done and how long will it take to install? WSNB4's Courtney Allen breaks down what we know so far. The Covenant School shooter got into the building by shooting through a window, a day that still haunts local parents. Anna Lance's daughter will be heading to school in just a few years. Nervous, yeah, we've actually contemplated just doing homeschool because just with everything going on. By the time she does, Lance hopes schools will be more secure. I would like to know that safety is important to them and they do all that they can to protect the kids while the parents aren't there to do it themselves. That's also the goal of Metro Nashville Public Schools. At a board meeting Wednesday night, Director of Schools Dr. Adrian Battle said MNPS and Metro Police are working together to install bulletproof film to school buildings. While there are a few practical levels of security that can completely stop someone with a weapon of war from gaining access to our buildings, we can make it more difficult and buy time for our staff to implement safety protocols and for the police to respond. Thursday, a district spokesperson told WSMV4 that while the district wants to do it as soon as possible, they have to find the money first. MMPS says the $5 million the project would cost would have to come from the city or through state or federal grants. Until the funding is secured, the district has no estimated date for installation. The way they spend the money, it, does, it all matters, but having kids be safe should be number one. We also asked the district if the film would be applied to all doors and windows at all schools. The district told us that they can't get into specifics. Courtney Allen, WSMB4.